Hey, what's up, YouTube? Okay, quick video response to Hiberia Sun, uh, latest vid, hold the line or head for the hills. And I basically agree with him 100% that people need to stick it out and uh, fight for the community in a SHTF or a collapse or whatever. Now, of course, if there is some sort of uh, immediate threat to your, to your body, uh, being like a, a biological outbreak or nuclear radiation or something like that, you know, that's a situation where, you know, you might have to head for the hills. But other than that, in a general sort of collapse, you know, I think the, the, the point that he's making is that rather than try and take your family and pack up and go to somewhere where uh, things are maybe not that bad, that, you know, you need to stay there and stick it out and work with the community to put things back on track. And again, you know, I, I totally agree with that. Um, he points out that if, if you know, all the, the good people sort of pack up and leave, then what's going to fill that vacuum? And he talks about, uh, you know, like kind of gangs and, and strong arm guys and this type of thing. And, and But what I'm saying is not only that, look at it at an even larger scale. If the whole majority of the country sort of... Uh, gives up, let's say, and, and packs up and heads for the hills. You know, this is how you get a Hitler figure to rise to power. So not only would you have the, on the on the local level, the vacuum attracting sort of, let's say, like the scum, but on a, on a national level, you know, you, the, the whole country gets put into an even uh, worse situation as far as a, a new leader. So that's something to think of too. Um, and, and also, you know, there, there is something to say for the fact that everyone's situation is a little different. I don't think you can totally have a hard and fast rule, uh, exactly about holding a line or heading for the hills. But what I would say is that you can have a hard and fast rule about not letting fear, uh, decide for you. And I think that's really important because, you know, all the stuff that we're facing is pretty terrifying, but, uh. I think the minute that you you start making your decisions based on fear is when you're going to get yourself into trouble and you know people got to come to grips with the fact that you know this is the time we live in and this is what we're facing and and you know we're the people here that have to face it and whatever that brings you know so that's uh those are my thoughts on it and I'm going to cut this one short keep it keep it quick uh, so that's it. Later, YouTube.